NC State was driving the new, clean, fast engines night while Duke was driving the lemon. The Wolfpack bullying the Blue Devils and shooting them out of the gym tonight, getting a big time win over the number 16 team in the nation, 86 to 60. Welcome into PNC Arena. I'm Chris Lee alongside Casey Hintz. Wow, what a game for it, NC State. This team got off to a 15 to nothing start in this game. Didn't allow Duke to start until about eight minutes into the game. Let's show you exactly what happened. And this particular series was a microcosm of what happened in this entire game. A missed three-pointer from Duke in the first half. And then Jarkel Joyner knocks in a three-pointer of his own. Duke immediately turns it over in the backcourt. Terquavion Smith knocks in his own three. A nine-point swing in just 20 seconds of game time. Smith led all scores with 24 points. NC State blows out Duke 86 to 60. We just wanted to get up in them. Uh, we preach a lot about how teams think they're nice just because the name on the front of their jersey. So, you know, we just took it personal and sat down on them. I don't care who's on that team, but just the Duke, I never thought I'd be on the same court with Duke. It's just, I mean, Duke, the culture. But, man, we are, we knew what type of team we are. We came in, we showed that, and we got a big win tonight. You guys um, lost against Clemson, came together, regathered re yourself, and blew out Duke on your home court, top 25 team. What does it say about this group? Uh, first, I want to give props to these guys, man. We came in after that loss. We practiced the next day, and every day forward, we took it seriously. They took it more serious than I feel like we've been all year, and it's something we really can build on. Of course, these NC State fans got the loudest when DJ Burns was on the court. When he had the ball in his hands, he's a new star for them. Kevin Keats called him a new fan favorite. Now, in the Duke locker room, I asked some of the guys about the big man. And, you know, they respected the performance and the tone, he said. But for them, it was all about what they didn't do. State came out, punched them in the mouth, and Duke didn't punch back. Now, John Shire said you could almost see it right away that the fight just wasn't there. Not being strong enough on defense, while State D got the Blue Devils out of sink and when it started to go that way they just didn't stick together that's something you're not used to seeing from a duke team now they were averaging just 11 turnovers on the season they had 13 in the first half finishing with a season high 21 now i asked kyle filipowski if he was surprised at all by the way they came out and played in this one he said absolutely it wasn't about preparation it was mentality i don't really think we have anyone to blame but ourselves uh you know as a team individually you know, you name it, there's, there's no excuses for the performance we all had tonight. Um, and I mean, all you can do is just watch film, learn from it, grow from it, and come out next game with a, more of a chip on our shoulder and make sure this never happens again. Just kind of thought the game was going to be easy. I mean, we should never expect that in the ACC game. Um, and I take, I take full, owner, full ownership of it. I mean, I'm the captain. I didn't get the guys ready. I didn't, get the, I didn't lead the guys today. So, I mean, give all the credit to, to NC State. Over in Chapel Hill, North Carolina hosting Wake Forest. UNC getting his offense early from Leaky Black in the first half. His three of his 14 points right here. Later on in the first half, Caleb Love, he's going to find Black in the three, from the, in the corner, four to three. But Wake Forest was hanging in tough. Dermari Monsanto got the triple right before halftime. And right now, UNC leads 67 to 64 in the second half. We'll have more from that game at 11 o'clock. But NC State blowing out Duke right here at PNC Arena. Big time game for them. Now, one thing you don't say about your opponent is that we thought the game was going to be easy. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. That that's was good. a little, yeah. you know. Yeah, they got the bad end of that one. All right. <laughs> thanks, guys.